Happy President's Day. Now today we're going to celebrate President's Day by drawing a president. Which one are we going to draw? James Madison. Yeah, and which president was he? The fourth. The fourth president. We hope you're going to follow along with us. You need something to draw with. We're going to use markers, some paper, and something to color with. Something to color with. All right, let's start. We're first going to draw his nose. We're going to draw it in the middle of our paper, and we're going to draw the letter L. We're going to curve down and then a little bottom, a little little line at the bottom. <laughs> so we're going to start right about here, draw a line down, and then there you go. Now let's draw his left eye. We're going to draw a circle over here, and I'm going to draw his right eye also the same size circle over on the right side. Yeah. Okay, now let's draw smaller circles in the top right of each eye. This is to make his eyes look shiny. Then we're going to color in the big circles. This part we're going to fast forward, but you guys can pause the video if you need time, extra time to finish this step. Now let's draw his mouth. We're going to draw a straight line underneath his nose. Even though he was probably very happy, I'm not sure he smiled much in photos or paintings, I mean. <laughs> All right, good job. Now let's draw this. a little smile. That's okay. <laughs> yeah, he's a little happy. Yeah. <laughs> now we're going to draw the bottom of his head or his chin. We're going to start here. We're going to draw a big U. Comes back up over onto the other side. Now let's draw his ears. We're going to draw a C shape on the left. Backward C over here on the right. Let's also draw the top of his head. We're going to draw, this is going to be a cool line. We're going to come up like this, and then right in the middle, we're going to come back down for his hair. <laughs> that would be funny if that yeah, was his head. Yeah, that's not the shape of his head. That's his hair. <laughs> yes, good job. Now let's draw his hair. We're going to start up here in the middle, and we're going to draw a line that comes down, and it's going to curve. We could also draw it a little wavy, too, coming down like that to the side of his head, and I'm going to repeat that same line over on this side. Come down, wavy, onto the other side. Yeah, good job. And we're going to connect it into his chin on the left and also over here on the right. We did it. We drew James Madison's head. <laughs> he needs a body now. Let's, yeah. draw, let's draw two lines coming down from his chin. Draw one on each side, coming down. I like drawing cartoon versions mm -hmm. of famous people, important people. Yeah. Now we're going to draw his legs. Down here at the bottom, we're going to draw a curve. We're going to leave a little space from that outside line. We're going to draw a curve that comes up and back down and leave a little space over here too. Yeah, and then let's connect those two lines with a straight line. And let's draw his shoes next. We're going to draw pointy shoes. One on the left and a pointy shoe on the right. <laughs> You're doing a great job. All right, now let's draw, let's draw a little buckle on his shoe. I'm going to draw a line in and up. Looks like another, a small little letter L. Yeah. All right, good job. Now let's draw his clothes. We're going to draw his waist first. Draw a line. Crossed. And then let's also draw his pants. We're going to draw, hey Ed, either short pants or really tall socks. I'm not sure. <laughs> Maybe both. <laughs> so draw a line on each leg. And then we're going to draw his jacket, his suit jacket. We'll draw a V. The letter V comes down back up right in the middle of his body. And then we can turn it into the letter Y by connecting the center of the V down. Now let's draw. Looks like a Y. It does look like the letter Y. And then we're going to draw another curve inside for his white shirt. And then let's draw a wiggly line, two wiggly lines coming down from that neck part. Yes. Now let's draw the flaps on his collar up here. And we're going to draw a sideways V, a big one. And then I'm going to draw a little one right below it. Yeah, good job. And then do the same thing on the other side, sideways V. And then a smaller sideways V below it. Good job. Oh, we could also add a little button. <laughs> and 
And also, I think maybe once in a while, you had a pocket watch, I'm gonna draw a little chain that comes down and back up. Cool, all right, he's missing his arms. Let's draw a diagonal line that comes down on the side of his body. Yes, and then we'll draw another diagonal line over here, and we wanna draw it kinda of close to his body. Oh yeah, you could draw it, or far away too. And why don't you come out a little farther, so his arm. Now this arm, you could draw differently. On this side, I'm gonna draw a curve that connects into his body. So right here, you could connect it. Yeah, because that would have been a huge... <laughs> yeah, this will be a really tough arm. But this one, you could draw a curve that comes around and then comes back up to his body. So it's a little out a ways from his body. That's okay, right? Yeah. I like that it's different. Okay, and then I'm gonna finish the hand over here. And let's draw two lines for the end of his sleeve on both arms. And we did it, Austin. Awesome. We finished drawing James Madison. Except we still need to do my favorite part. What is it? Color it. Yeah, we need to color him. This part we're gonna fast forward, but at the end you guys can pause the video to match the same color. You ready to fast forward? Yeah. Austin, give me five. You did such a great job on coloring. What's his name again? James Madison. James Madison, the fourth president of the United States. You can be super proud of your drawing, and it's okay that our two drawings look different. They both turned out awesome, especially yours. And it's okay if their drawings turn out different too, because the most important thing is to have fun. Have fun and to practice. Practice. Remember to practice. Happy President's Day, and we'll see you later, our friends. Goodbye. Goodbye.